Hi and welcome to day number 19 of my 30 days for health. I've been shopping again this evening. Uh, I just wanted to share with you again what I bought today. Um, I've just uploaded my photos of what I've been eating today. You can see I started off this morning with blueberry porridge, which to be honest has probably been my favorite. Um, and then for lunch, I had a blueberry and chocolate smoothie. Um, then I had a snack of peanut butter on rice cakes, but they're not just any rice cakes. I found these wonderful whole grain rice cakes. So this is the key. Remember, you are allowed brown rice, and it's also got uh, quinola and corn in as well, and they're by Sainsbury's, gluten-free. So I would really recommend having some of those much healthier rice cakes. And because they're whole grain, they won't absorb into your body too quickly. Hi, Natasha. Hi, Janice. Daddy, cool. Um, and then uh, you've seen in the photos as well, I've had asparagus and salmon for my main meal this evening. Now, let me just show you quickly what I bought. Now, what I've been really finding is, when you buy a lot of healthy foods, you know, you need to be shopping every three or four days because if you buy more than that, it's just, it, it doesn't, the food doesn't last enough. And when I put it in the fridge, I actually group it together as I'm going to eat it. Therefore, stuff doesn't go off because you know what's with what. So I put together in my uh, um, fridge the broccoli with the chicken thighs and this is probably one of my favorite meals ever. That really is delicious. Obviously, I've put my asparagus with my salmon, which I've already eaten. Now, I saw a great recipe, which is just salad. So I've got onions, beetroot, cucumber, and tomato. And you just make the dressing from lemons, extra virgin olive oil, and a little bit of mixed herbs. So I'm going to make that salad for Sunday when I go with Claire to Alton Towers. Now also when I go on Alton Towers in my little picnic area, I've got some fresh strawberries which I'm going to take along. I'm also going to take some hummus which is going to be really delicious. I'm going to take my uh, corn rice cakes which, and I'm going to take the almond butter and the 100% peanuts, peanut butter. And then there's a slight treat because I know Claire likes them. I'm also going to take some falafels, which I got today from Aldi. If you read the ingredients, 62% uh, chickpea, uh, rapeseed oil, um, and it can, does contain dates and apricots. So slight ingredients there that I shouldn't be having, but there's nothing unnatural in there, so which is a great thing. Uh, I was joking about the roller coaster. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually going on the roller coaster. Um, and then obviously hummus, which is great just to dip in. I'm going to take some little carrot sticks and I've got some celery left from last week. Um, I just topped, topped up on the old almond milk unsweetened. I was talking to uh, some of my guys today about the almond milk. When I'm having my smoothies, I'm just making it with water. Although this tastes nice, um, it's very calorific, so it's important if you've got the calories from protein powder, you don't really want to add any more because the taste is just too much. I bought some green apples, um, and then I bought the right ingredients. Remember when I was looking for linseed? So it's, this is a linseed mix, and this has in there some sunflower and some pumpkin seeds and that was for the granola. Happy shopping, Maureen! Um, I've also bought some cacao powder because as you've seen last week I went mental on this stuff. I made loads of stuff so I bought another one of those. Um, and then I'm going to make the sweet potato mash again. So I've got some courgettes and some sweet potatoes. My shopping came to £29.69. So I've probably got enough food here for me and Claire for the weekend and probably myself for another couple of days as well. Um, so price-wise, it's actually doing really, really good. Um, and I've bought some sparkling water because, again, I find that as a real nice treat just to keep that in the fridge. And in the evening, you know, I do enjoy a nice glass in my wine glass. Uh, Bev, I used to water in my smoothie in the morning. It was lovely. Yes, you don't really need uh, any of these expensive milks. So I would definitely just add water to the smoothie. Um... 
Lastly, what I would say about shopping, guys, you know, it's really my hate. My mum hates going food shopping with me because I'm really slow and I like to read all the labels and all the ingredients. So I really think, you know, like a Friday and a Saturday night when there's not many people milling around is perfect. And try and go alone as well, guys, so you can really study what you're buying and you don't make mistakes and buy something that's not going to do your health very good and that's obviously going to take away from your health plan. Um, so if you're, you're a traditional Saturday morning shopper or you go on a Sunday, which now is probably the busiest day for all supermarkets, you know, really try and go every couple of days and go on your own and really plan, plan your supermarket time so you can enjoy the experience and really get some good bargains as well as buying the things you need. Hello Yvonne, welcome to the live video. Right, I've got to go and pick up Claire now from the, the train station. So this is why I did the video slightly early. We're going to have lots of fun videos this weekend, including live from Alton Towers on Sunday. Tomorrow she's coming to all my classes, including a very special pink class tomorrow evening at Branston Golf Club. So goodbye for now, guys. Maybe we'll go live in the morning when I make Claire some breakfast and see what she thinks. Bye for now. Bye.